Let me see that. No, you can see this one. I want the banana one. You want the okay. You, you spoil it. Oh. <laughs> Alright, so trying to do something different with reviews. Not that I'm tired of doing softball reviews, softball bat reviews that is. But you crunching on that is killing their ears right now, I'm just oh. telling you. <laughs> so uh we're gonna check out a little bit of different products here. What we're working with is the uh, all-star tiger stick. And then the uh, bat tech, I think it's the ball players bomb bat tech. A couple of uh, different products here. Basically, going to be like an alternative for like pine tar, something that's supposed to be sticky, and not just make a mess of your gloves and your bat and everything else. A lot of guys in softball like to use like 3M spray. Uh, having experience with that, I will definitely want to uh, see what this is like. This might be a decent alternative. And also not something that you have to like try and keep track of the cap of, worry about the clogging up. Uh, it's going to be something that you can just grab out of the bag and go with. Now, one thing I do want to point out, hopefully it's going to focus for us there, do not consume. Now, you might wonder, why does it say that? Well, it is banana scented. They so, already knew that. Well, they knew that because you ran your mouth. <laughs> All right, so... Let's let's go here. First 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 reaction. Smell like bananas? You know, like it looks like a banana. Does it matter? I mean like it just looks like somebody mashed a banana down in there. This one doesn't smell like a banana. No. It smells like nothing. You got these just smell like a banana. No, there's no smell with this one. We, we were just curious. It's not advertised to have one. The tiger stick doesn't have one. We were just kind of curious to see what it would do. Ah. So what's the play here? You think like rub it on the bat? What's this not? Can you smell it better now? Oh yeah, you can actually. <laughs> Ain't that I don't bad. trust you to like jam it in my face. Oh no. It smells like stronger now. Ooh. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let you, I'm gonna let you do your thing with that one. Gladly. So uh, we're going to put a handful of swings on each of these, put some on, get some swings, put the other on, get some more swings, kind of see what we think here. Oh, shoot. Is it recorded? Yeah. Oh, shoot. What's up, y'all? Yeah. My bat and tape smells like a banana now. Here's the other one. I can't remember what the name of this is. It doesn't smell, I'll tell you that. Here you go. So, I think they're both the same. So picky. I think they're both the same. This one just smells better. Um, couldn't really feel a difference in the swings. Like I said, this one just smells better. So, the banana first. Up 
ball. It's a one piece ball, trashy spin for you. I noticed right away that the bat tack wore off really fast. Let's see what the tiger stick does here. I can see this one going on. That's all I got, kids. I feel like these are both pretty decent. This is something that, did you feel like, how long do you feel like it lasted? I mean, it la it's still on here. Yeah. Do you feel like it was as sticky as it was when you first put it on? Yeah, I feel like. Yeah. And, like, that's definitely, that's really sticky. Mm -hmm. So, like, they're both definitely pretty sticky. I will say on the older grip, um, it did seem like that the Tiger Stick lasted a little longer. Either of these, I think, are good, though. And maybe not something, like, you could put on and take a whole round of BP with. But nonetheless, I feel like this is a decent product. It's a good alternative to pine tar, which is extremely messy and obviously not going to be as sticky either. But like pine tar is to be rivaled by none. <laughs> but for like the guys that are into like the 3M spray and stuff like that, um, maybe a simpler solution. Maybe you could goop it on. It might go on better in the summertime too. But I will say, I would be careful putting these on in the summertime. Put, sorry, putting these in your bag in the summertime. Mm -hmm, it'll melt. Yeah, you're right. Might, maybe, I don't know. We'll see. Maybe we should go home and like put them in the oven. You can mom kill us. Yeah, probably. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, that's it for this one. Uh, if you're interested in either one of these, are available at headbangersports.com. Um, discount code does not work on these just because it's kind of an uh, off-brand product from the stuff that uh, would work for my discount code. But I can still get you set up with one of these, or you can go to the website and get them, whatever you want to do. So are in case you hit it. Be hang on. Don't end the video. I got to hit a softball. Oh, he's going to hit a softball. Here, hang on, hang on, hang on. You gotta tack up, bro. Yep, tack up. Tack, tack up, up, bro. Tack up, up, bro. Oh, yeah, see, don't go on there. Really All right, then I'll hit a baseball. Yeah, there you go. Ah. One more. Oh, oh, he's the one more. He's the one more guy. He's the one more, one more. Oh. That's a rip, son. That's a rip, son. First time I played baseball, how long? I don't know, since you hit me grounders. Well, I mean, like, legitimate. Like, oh, probably like five years. What's this, 31 inches? I forgot about that. Yeah. Oh. Oh, okay. The bat flip wasn't easy.